What's the biggest scam people still fall for? Those Microsoft scam calls. It works so well, that they have offices or mayo. Online charlatans that will share their secrets, if you buy their course. Hey babe. I've just come into some really great opportunities with this amazing team of women. And since that opportunity is still available of course I thought of you. They're looking for hardworking ladies who want to empower each other, by starting their own businesses. I know that sounds scary, but just wait, until you see the paycheck at the end of it, you can be your round bus, and take control of your fin and lol just kidding could you imagine? Not gonna lie. I attended one of those pyramid scheme meetings at my friend's insistence and man it was filled with low income people and the whole thing was clearly targeted at them. Felt really bad seeing how they were being sold dreams of earning a lot of money and stuff. Such a scam. Do you have a moment to talk about your car's factory warranty? The sauna slim belt was a thing in my country for almost a decade. People never lost an inch of fat. Only got marks from the heat which the belt produced. Pure scam. The old pyramid scheme still works despite being old, and every tray of it being widely known. Sometimes you can't beat a classic. These facebook posts imitating real companies saying you'd win whatever they're offering. Despite the page, being created hours ago, and the only post being said giveaway. The comments are always tragic to read. Mobile games which are designed to be bad, so they can frustrate you enough to buy their currency. Failing that, the game will feature spam clicking, until you run out of energy, which will spawn a buy more energy pop up, hoping you will buy lots of it by accident. I have several clients, that fell for the scamware, when you do a password reset on a bank website and they text you a code, to complete the password reset, and the scammer calls you for the code. If you receive a code via text, never tell it to someone else. You'll get a job at X organization, if you pay X amount. It's always a scam. You never have to pay someone to work for them. Edit. Since I work in its sector, I was talking about that. This happens especially more to fresh out of college folks looking for a job. Nigerian Prince MLs I can't believe people still fall for them. But apparently it's a multi-million dollar industry. Weight loss pills and weight loss tea. Looking for one hard worker, to replace two who weren't. Penis enlargement pills. I'll pay in gift cards. Is that okay? Multi-level marketing. I sometimes think about what happened to all that Lolero. Taking photos with the characters in Times Square. New York City. Buying a timeshare. Expensive coffins. Diamond rings. Bottled water. Timeshare promise. Jim Ducking Backer. My nephew. Who is around 22 or 23 now is a youth minister. When he first started doing minister training, or whatever it's called he went to a camp that Jim Backer and his son own, and trained there for like a year. He's so young that he probably hadn't even heard of what the backers are most famous for. Being con artist pieces of crap. And I never talked about them around him, because he was an adult choosing his own path. But man did I hate it. To this day he's still good friends with Jim's son. If you tell me the truth I won't get mad, mum slash dad. Televangelists. Reddit gold. Having to share at least your ML address permission to mail with any company that you want to purchase a product from or interact with just so they can spam your inbox with garbage marketing campaigns sure you can unsub use a non-primary ml address etc but i still hate it maybe biased because i work for one of the world's largest big data marketing agencies online reviews a huge percentage of them are written but the seller if good, or by a competitor, if not. Scientology. Nice try. Op. Give us your credit card info, and we'll tell you. Privatizing profits while socializing costs. We can't afford raises this year. Company that turns around, and pays dividends to shareholders, 